what's up my family what's up my tbh family what are y'all doing today um this is just a quick 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 uh video i was just sent what i'm about to show you from my husband um y'all know that he is a trucker if you don't know he is he drives semi trucks um we just had this discussion about prices of things going up prices of fuel lumber unnecessary um so he received this and he passed it on to me. I'm now gonna pass it on to you. I just got it. So be mindful. This will affect everything. This will affect everything. Remember when I said trucks need to keep their wheels spinning. If they're not spinning, there is an issue. Well, this could cause those wheels to not spin because of the inflation that is happening right now. So I'm just letting you know, pass it on, share it out with whoever you need to share it out with. Um, things are not getting any better. Things are drastically, and in some cases to the extreme, to the point where we won't be able to afford a lot of things that we normally would. Yes, you might not be using diesel, you know, but if it hits them, it hits us. So be mindful, stay prepared, do what you have to do, get the items that you need to get while the supplies are being delivered because we already experiencing shortages in the stores. Deliveries are not making it there. The ones that do are not being put out because of workforce shortages. So I say that to say this, don't let anyone tell you that you should not be doing what you're doing. If they don't see it, then that's their problem, not yours. Your, your concerns is your family, your household, and maybe a few extended family members get together, have a conversation. Who's going to do this? Who's going to do that? You know, so everybody is contributing and not everybody is running to, well, I know they're stocking up, so I'm going to go to their house. Include them in the conversation. If they don't want to do it, then that is on them. You did your part. You did your part. You were put here to take care of your children, your family. But you cannot do everything. You cannot feed everyone, no matter how much you want to. And it's okay if you have extra and you want to say, do put extra aside, do that for the just in case. So you're not taken away from your stockpile for your family in case of crisis. Y'all have a blessed day. And don't forget to hit a like and subscribe if you have not. Also, I was watching a mukbang video. If you don't know what that is, that's where people sit, eat, talk, have a conversation. This video, no, this commercial popped up and I just want to say, and y'all excuse my French, what the hell is going on? What is this? What is this? Are you serious? This got to be a joke, right? This has to be a joke. Get down in them comments and talk to me. So seriously, um, y'all, we need to pray. We, we need to really, seriously, we need to pray if. I mean, I, I'm lost. I'm lost. The world's finest plant-based, cruelty-free human meat. Because we believe you should eat what you love. Try our new Yorkerless strip steak, guiltless grilled rack of Sam, or our manless meatballs and marinara. Our human-inspired menu tastes so much like real human. After just one bite, you'll be waiting for the police to arrive. 
So indulge in the dining experience so authentic, even non-vegan cannibals will love it too. The Vegan Cannibal Steakhouse, where nobody gets killed. Available exclusively on Postmates. Seriously. Find out how to order at liquiddeath.com slash vegan cannibal.